My name is Natalia Salazar and I come from Ecuador. As the Paris 2015 COP21 is approaching, I am addressing you, Senor Presidente, uh, for a call for action in climate change. Ecuador and the rest of countries worldwide are striving for sustainability, a life within the means of our environment and within the time frame that benefits the lives of future generations, our sumacausai or good living. Climate change has reached the north, the south, the east, and the west of the earth, our home, New Gallacta. In Ecuador, it has, it has reached the Galapagos Islands, the Andes, the Amazon rainforest, and the Pacific coast. The population of endemic species on the Galapagos Islands has fallen by 50% or more since the 1990s, and mangrove forests along the Pacific coast have lost thousands of hectares, according to the World Wildlife Fund. Other research tells us that glaciers in the Andes have shrunk between 30 and 50 percent in the last 30 years. And um, can we? Yeah. Sorry, yeah. Can you just start again from the, uh -huh. the top? Other research. Yeah. Other research tells us that glaciers. No. Okay. Uh huh. Other research tell us that glaciers in the Andes have shrunk between 30 and 50 percent in the last 30 years, and deforestation in the Amazon rainforest is increasing, while biodiversity is decreasing. Ecuador has been recognizing the rights of nature in our constitution and place environmental standards at the heart of policy through successive national plans since 2007. But how can we ensure these environmental standards are met or that this work continues? One way is to promote public-private partnerships for local action, especially using small and medium-sized enterprises. Representing 96% of business, they are the economic engine of the country. Educate their workforce and you will educate their families and children. Another way is to bridge the North and South divide across the world to find a common agreement, one that brings us all at the Paris COP convention in November. Sea usted el eslabón. Señor Presidente, I urge you to lead our country towards a common future, as stated by Pope Francis, and ensure work continues towards climate change adoption and mitigation. Suma Causai is more than good living. It is cooperation, complementary, reciprocity, and solidarity. Soy simplemente una voz, pero usted es la de millones de ecuatorianos. Gracias.